Hey there, welcome back. A Fresno First will open its doors to the public in just a couple of hours. We're talking about a brand new rooftop bar. And our Gabe Salazar visited Quail State in downtown Fresno and shows us what they're all about. Gabe. Yeah, that's right. The anticipation has been building up for far too long. And at 5 p.m. tonight, those who made reservations in advance will be able to wine and dine overlooking the downtown Fresno cityscape. Now, we checked in with co owner Josh Islas Wolf the other day to talk about what it's like opening a one of a kind restaurant in such a unique time. Take a look. Located in the heart of downtown, Quail State is now officially Fresno's first and only rooftop bar. Uh, Quail State is actually a name that came to me years and years ago. It's actually the state bird of California. A lot of people, weirdly enough, don't know that. Or maybe it's weird that I know that. Quail State is located on the corner of Fulton and Mariposa. To get to the restaurant, you take the elevator up to the second floor of the historic Pacific Southwest building, where you are led to the indoor bar and then to the beautiful rooftop dining area. Area. Creating an environment that the Central Valley can be proud of. Uh, something, a place that showcases the uh, natural uh, flora and fauna of this uh, state. One of their seasonal craft cocktails, the Mariposa, takes inspiration from the beautiful surroundings of the Central Valley. Here's how it's made. Well, today we're going to be making a drink that I love called the Mariposa. So the bright, vibrant color of this drink is, uh, it reminded me a lot of the the butterflies I'd see around this time of year. So that's why we named it this way. It's a seasonal drink. We only make this one in spring and summer here at Quail State. And we uh, add tequila. We add ancho verde, which is a poblano chili based liquor. Super tasty, not too not too hot. I know a lot of people get scared, like, oh no, poblano chilies. This is gonna be really intense. It's not that bad. It's super tasty, really fun, really balanced. Looks super beautiful. Quail State is not trying to be an exclusive environment. We want this place to be um, available to anybody who wants to experience Fresno in a new light. Top it with a candied mango with tahini and an edible flower. Quail State has been the passion project of Josh and Haley Islas Wolf two years in the making. It's also the first bar and restaurant they owned and operated from the ground up, pushing their creative vision and inclusion in the workforce, all during a worldwide pandemic. Uh, my wife especially, this is also her first business venture, and being a woman in this industry for her is... Um, been, it's been challenging at times to be taken seriously, but she's persevered through all of that, and, and she's a COO of a company in Fresno, and that's wonderful, at, especially for anybody. And so I think, um, if you're, especially if you're a woman, uh, to make sure that you keep going and, and don't take no for an answer because you deserve every opportunity that comes your way. So if you want to secure a spot on the rooftop, listen up, because there's a chance that might not be anytime soon, as they are already seeing reservations booked almost a month out. Quail State is not trying to be an exclusive environment. We want this place to be um, available to anybody who wants to experience Fresno in a new light. So we are politely refusing uh, larger parties at this time uh, until such a time that we can accommodate safely. As their first project completes, they move right on to the next one as they try to accomplish another Fresno first. Uh, I mean, say, keep your eyes peeled for St. Joaquin. We'll be opening up uh, Fresno's first natural wine bar um, in the Peerless building here in the next few months. That's going to be a lot of fun, man. Yeah. So we're doing natural wine, 50% uh, of the wine at that uh, bar is going to be female run and operated. All right, so if you'd like to try to get your spot on the rooftop, we do have a link on our website, yourcentralvalley.com, but no promises at all. And you definitely want to stay tuned as I'm going to be keeping tabs on their upcoming project, St. Joaquin, in the near future. I love it. I just want more restaurants to be outside. Right. I want to be up and outside. I love it. Thank you so much, Gabe. Of course. And coming up next, we meet a rising star of the